Meghan Markle must not speak out about one particular thing if she is to meet the Queen's expectations, according to a royal expert. Katie Nichol, author of Harry, Life, Loss and Love, claims that if the Duchess of Sussex starts getting political she'll be in hot water. The royal biographer said, there's no problem with Meghan speaking out on feminism, social justice and equality issues, but if she starts getting political she'll be in hot water. The Queen is politically neutral. She expects her family to do the same. However, Meghan seems to see activism as a family affair. She said at a Royal Foundation forum in February, Harry and I see the world so similarly in our approach of being very hands-on with things. Meghan previously used her celebrity to back Hillary Clinton in the 2016 presidential election and attacked Donald Trump as misogynistic and divisive. She has worked as an ambassador for United Nations Women and the charity World Vision. The royal family has backed charities with social causes for years and the Queen has been a patron or president of more than 600. These range from wildlife groups and sporting bodies to military organizations. However, the royals are expected to keep clear of politics. Despite this, various royal family members have made many politically incorrect blunders over the years including Meghan's husband Prince Harry. Ari had to apologize in January 2009 after a video emerged of him referring to Asian army colleagues using derogatory language. He was also pictured wearing a Nazi uniform at a costume party, sparking outrage across the globe. His grandfather Prince Philip is well known to make politically incorrect comments during royal visits and events. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are due to have their first baby very soon. The child will almost certainly continue the long tradition of supporting royal causes, but this will also constrain them when it comes to politics.